good. It's a 50 50 between the competition. It's second? But second time? Who? To be whether they live or Jax? get sent back home. It's Onik. Nope, e second time. Up you missed it against Blacklist I mean, guys, GX, GX is not in the same so tournament. They're in M3.0. Not M3. So much stress. Well, let's GX go is then. in the oh, different tournament, guys. Right you, don't forget. Go Onik or hashtag break the code. We want to see who has the most feisty fans right now as we are already into this game. Gonna be a really matchup into the side lanes. Wait, what Double the fuck? The Already jungle gap, I'm seeing. The high loss for sure, but in a way that Edward can make the place for uh, as well. Top lane is the more um, even one in a way. I think it's the more. Yeah, I would agree with you. It's definitely the more even one. Nobody's really gonna get anywhere unless they want to get. Okay, really sense. Really Let me see that so far, Indo champion like, Lancelot, bro. Change the odds in towards Beatrix's favor. Oh, Arbor carried the shit out of him with that Lance yesterday or two so days ago. Let's see. Just but this guy's gonna pull up. Is also, that also means extra strength in that side lane and already they have the night one. I mean they really couldn't get that crap because it's Cecilia yeah, and Rafaela mid and Rafael is not even mid. So how can they get but like I said again, if you look at Blacklist team com, it's literally their counter pick. If they lose this, it's gonna hurt them. It's gonna hurt their ego. It's gonna hurt them inside. Ooh, okay. Tough, it's really, really Relax. Oh, oh dash, dash, dash. Ooh, free turtle. Might be free turtle. Brass in a bad position. Oh. Oi! Why is what the fuck? Wait, wait. Oi, Matilda! Turtle! Lap of the turtle! Edward God! But Sans? Sans? Sheesh! Oh, is there any more? Nope. Looks like they finally. Sans is missing that red tree oh, back and forth. Damn, that OMV with the Matilda second skill, though. Holy shit. Bro, it would have been so bad for a blacklist, but now they're in favor. They got the turtle, they got the kill, and Varus didn't even die. Oh, move chat? My bad. My bad. Eesh. Every time I see the far so low and a Clint, I would just think, oh my god, it's a sin moment. It's a sin moment when he just flickers forward and goes for the kill. But yeah, again, for the side of Onyx Esports, what they need to but do guys, is that Kiwi boy safe, on that Rafaela, he never dies. Right now. He always he performs. Yeah, they're, they're controlled Wait, Beatrix snipe? So oh, only if we predicted. Oh shit. Oh shit. To oh, shit. Out CW from this side to continue they're denying him so hard. CW is having a nightmare tonight. <laughs> Beatrice got all the turret gold. If you look at Beatrice's gold, almost 3k. The most gold in the game. Pixel perfect, each player plays this. I mean, even Wise, he activated the so called teamwork to kind of uh, assume where CW will be. And CW Bro, C9, I mean, not C9, CW has uh, like area. really yeah. bad game right today they because they're focusing him really hard. They if you look at Lapu's positioning right now, Bro, what the fuck am I watching? Yeah, the thing is, it's really good for a setup onto the turtle, right? You get someone to recall, and that is Venus the guy. Oh my god, okay. it's gonna be the cage, the cage Wait. catching two members. But again, it's all just for the setup, and right now. Oh, this might be free turtle. I don't think they can contest this. Just go bottom lane. Just contest this turtle. They are going to give it away. Yep. The big red team. The but if they all go to bottom lane, top is free. You get easy access to the objectives, particularly the turtle. This just looking good just for blacklist, but at the same time, Onik. The only right? objective for Onik is late game. The only way for them to be able to secure a, a 
a turtle or a neutral objective is that if they poke Blacklist International so low that they have to back down. I mean, let's not forget that, you know, a bo the perfect execution as well as Sicilian's all already being expanded in that initial top dive. And I think that, that was also one of the couple of reasons. Like, yes, it is difficult, but also, you know what? No, of we, course not late game lands. We really don't have good odds. Might as well give it away. We'll find a late game Clint and Sicilian. Oh my oh, god. Ooh, I'm already that? seeing some jungle gab. Literally just for twice and the twin blades yep. of Edward. Oh my god. Half HP taken away. And this is the thing. Edward and Wise. Wise is two levels ahead of Sans and in the top side. Blacklist Wait, Blacklist yep, is popping off. So this high loss, he pops down the glorious pathway and it looks like, I mean, they get him low, but really doesn't matter. It is high loss. Sans is there to cover him for now. But let's not Wait, forget, they're, they're losing top turret, bottom turret, every turret. Edward going to be taking bot tier one. One of the specials of Edward is that he is That's the Sicilian for you. Zero prio. But still, late game Sicilian is insane. Late game Clint is insane. This is what I was talking about earlier. Onik is confident that Blacklist is not gonna end them. Late game. So they're gonna have late game for sure. That's what they're trying to do. I think they're also utilizing their way clear. They're just playing safe. Yeah, they are utilizing give what they have to give. What they need to understand right now is that they do not have the lane pressure. Bleed as little as as, as little possible. Mid control is just all on the hands of Blacklist International. The downside of picking the Sicilian, yes, you yeah. can scale to the late game, but in that early stage, yes. up to the mid game, you can you can kind of say you're useless, right? You can't you can't run Wait, as fast as the far. Did he snipe the blue? Around anywhere on the map except for that mid lane, and even yeah. in the mid lane, you're not going to be able to do a lot. Wait, who? A whole lot of damage. Did Farsa get the, the blue? Really provide is that cage, right? Getting the CC done. No, they didn't snipe the blue. It is very hard to land. It. It's always like okay, it's very strong when it. No, Lens look at the blue, right? Yeah, Lens got it. What are you guys talking about? Yep, we're seeing Hylos already be dropping down the glorious pathway here. Just to ensure, draw a line in the sand, say, hey, Blacklist National, we don't want you taking our mid-tier. Wait, are we watching the same game? With that. Uh, we saw what happened Since... last time. Better Wait, what? Not, not Is it a bug? In game number two, we saw uh, Blacklist International get to four turtles, and it seems like it is... In it says Lance got it. Uh, the trajectory that Blacklist International wants to go for 91 seconds from to th from this time means that they will get another curl. Well, here we go, ever engaging on the, the fuck is CW thinking? Well, CW He's farming, bro. Yeah, again, He's like, they're punching you, and you're like, keep uh, eating the lunch. It's like, it's be fucking eating the lunch. The, <laughs> the bullies <laughs> fucking hitting you. You can't stop eating. So let's wait for this Sicilian to become a threat. Now, oh, good vision. Up here comes the siege once again. Wise and as well as Haji doing a phenomenal job. of Boots is holding the lane back, making sure that this tier one not looking good, bro. Black is oh, shitting on him. To do so, good shots, but you can see that Oheb he's just slowly chipping away at it. This is oh, illegal, this man. Is... Look, it's gonna be him taking it without the minions. Oh, he's gonna get, get it. He's gonna get it. One more. Should not be. Allowed. Oh my god. Oh my god. Not again. Reckless International. Once again, 5,000 gold lead in the eighth minute of the game. Onyx Esports boots. He's able to zone away the members, but. but I told you that is a disrespect pick. It's a silly game. Very but unlike the second game, still not late game. They, well. they, they still can the defend well. They have the pressure and Clint Sicilian, defendable. Yep, it's, it's stressful. They can it's stressful. defend like three lords at once. Hyper defensively yep. here, and it's uh, they haven't made too many crazy plays at all. And more importantly, the key boy is making sure when he opens up the map, he's playing it. Very, he's well, but the thing is, they have Lapu and Farsa, so they can probably push in. The also, Beatrix you snipes. Be in this position if you're the Lancer, you want to always go for the kill. This is game three, last game. Loser goes home. Ooh, Farsa damage. Ooh, ooh, Keyboy. Ooh, Barats. Ooh. Okay. That's the blacklist we know. Jeez. Three games in a row. This guy is on a roll. Even when in the game that they damn, this might be just over, guys. So dominant in the lane on this Beatrix, and right now, again, it is gonna be a free lord for the side of Blacklist International. Nine minutes. It's the ultimate bonding experience. Massive jungle diff. Massive. Actually, like Lance can't really do anything, right? They got fucking Raphael and Sicilian. What can Lance do? He can't. He's not a god. He cannot just one v five. In this is team to set up something. Only 
is only on CW and uh, the side. Oh my God! Side of AK gold lead, guys. In ten minutes. Up to the point where he's a huge How? Right now. It might be over before it even it starts for Onik. That's definitely uh, a big scary factor for all of the Onik esports fans now. Wait, they actually they cannot defend now. The gold is too too big. Clinton's a ceiling has zero damage. And that's and, uh, this is the biggest oh my coming in between both of the teams played 4k yep it, it's 9k now and it's about to be it might even be an inhibitor if they do this right here comes a feather airstrike once okay Rapu comes in as well but keyboy has a really good ultimate Hylos is distract everybody that was a really good play by butts over the wall for safety the next wave is coming through perfect execution coming out for the side wait defend the turret they survive can they hold the snipe they hold the inhibitor but all have says nah false hope i'm breaking it regardless oh my goodness mm. this this renner plays from oheb you know i think that oheb and all of the beatrix fans out there they might be blaming oheb for a nerf in the next patch this <laughs> performance it kind of asks for a nerf right it yeah. kind of does but once again they're doing it just like the fuck? one as onyx performed against blacklist now boots going in for an engagement on top of oh my venus they told us well oh no they hilo says, no oh. oh. says no flicker hilo says no flicker though they have to pull through holy baptism Ooh, does no way nobody dies no way they survived goodness. Why is making sure? Oh, that oh he baby! Behold! Oh, Behold the Beatrix! This, guy, oh the this is a disaster! Right look at this man! This is Onik literally on the Sicilian the pig is really is fucking like them up! Keep on going in and man, it's over. It is ferocious. It is it's like over. A disaster for Onik. Yep, it's not looking good at all. <laughs> it's man. over. What is this game? There, but Boots, he's trying his very best. They're getting Dango out. So Look at that snipes. You need to stop getting hit by this Filipino. Bro, sniper. why would you? <laughs> it does not miss. The thing is, Blacklist International are really making it massive so draft gap. Massive draft gap. So that Oheb will be what am I watching? The Lapu -Lapu as well as the Matilda to just peel through the numbers of Onyx Esports and Wise always makes it make sure that he is always near the vicinity of Oheb so that whenever Onyx Esports wants to initiate, he's there for the Detonus welcome so that he'll eventually stop the aggression for Onyx Esports. And not to mention Haji as the of uh, the vision uh, provider for Blacklist International that Feathered Airstrike really zones out the members of Onyx Esports. Look at so Sans, he's typing. This is Just like us in rank game. Standing still and be like, bro, what the fuck? I've brought this up before, but like when you see Cecilian, do something. And Cecilian's like, bro, hold. I just need 20 more minutes to pop off. Can we hold for 20 minutes? Like, look at him in my face. How can we hold 20 minutes? How? They're pushing in. They don't even need Lord. No, Cecilian. What a disaster. They're just coming in like tsunami. Edward, Beatrix, Beatrix, game's over, game's over, it's a wrap. Look at them snipes, look at them snipes, he's hitting the base. Oh, Forza, they're trying so hard. <laughs> Is that basic on Nasrot? Guys, MP. Yeah, Indo going oh home. My God, Chris, MPL champion going home. Blacklist International, the Filipino champs. PTK winning M3? Question mark. MPL and MPLI champions. Oh my God, that was what is this? amazing and what a match. That match. Why did it, wait? It who PayPal Onik? Blacklist have achieved <laughs> their sweet. Well, sweet during the draft, the pop up comes in like. In MPLI, the they're like, "Yo, pick Sicilian. We give you twenty k diamonds." It's like bad, worse, worse. <laughs>